subscribe our channel for daily technology and smartphone videos hello friends welcome to my youtube channel and today oneplus released their first official android 9.0 open beta 1 for oneplus 6 users yes it's first open beta 1 for oneplus 6 users and it consists of android p 9.0 and many other features so in the coming section of this video i will show you how to install this particular version on stable version and uh, what are the new features they have added in this open beta 1 and what are the known issues involved in this particular open beta 1 so if you like this video please hit like and subscribe to our channel and without any further delay let's get started This is the community page, and as you can see, they have mentioned that Oxygen OS Open Beta One for the One Plus Six has been released, and this is change log. And as you can see, they have mentioned that the update system to Android 9.0 Pi. So the first Open Beta version it itself is on 9.0, so it's a very good news for the One Plus Six users. So brand new UI has been added, new Android P gestures has has been added, and other new features added. Integrated One Plus customization features, so it's a good thing. These are the known issues. Some applications may not function as expected. So, because this is a beta version and not a stable version, so if you want to install, install it on your own risk. And uh, Google Play services is not working. Okay, fine. And Google Play Store might show device is not certified by Google. So, these three things are the known issues. And they have provided the instruction over here uh, how to install this particular Android P beta version on stable version. So, first download the ROM upgrade from this uh, specified server. So, you need to click here. to download the update package and this is my OnePlus 6 device and i have already downloaded this particular uh, 1.49 gb file copy rom update package in the mobile phone storage okay fine and uh, settings uh, i will show you how to install this particular rom package and make sure you have a good uh, battery uh, more than 50% of battery so let's we will try installing this particular rom file so let me go to the file manager storage section download section and this is my today's file i will move this file in the parent folder so this is my 1.6 gb file today's file september 3 okay so now let's go to the system let me show you my current version as you can see it's 5.1.11 it's running on 5.1.11 So let's go to system updates. Here you will find this gear option on top right corner. Hit choose local upgrade. And here your file will appear. This is the file 3rd September. So I will just install this file. Install now. And it will take couple of minutes to complete the installation process. So I will come back once the installation is completed. So after about 10 minutes the installation is successfully completed so i will enter the password over here and uh, let me see what are the new changes Okay so here it is so i have completed the installation process and all the applications are there my data is there so the one thing is sure that there is no data loss if you update this from the stable version So first uh, let's check the android version and straight away you can see a new android p uh, ui over here so let me go to the about phone and this is something new to me let's go to oxygen os version open beta 01 as you can see and android version 9 and build this is the build number and i don't see any security patch level not a problem we will find out so let's see all the features one by one So the first uh, feature they have mentioned that updated system to Android 9.0. We have already seen that it's a 9.0 version, brand new UI for Android P, and yes, it's a brand new UI. As you can see, this is the Android P kind of uh, notification bar which we have already seen on the developer preview. And again, if we go to the systems, this is almost similar to stock Android which we always get on the Pixel phones. This is almost similar. Uh, let me show you. As you can see, let me change the theme if I can, so that you can visible it morely. Uh, oh, it's a colorful theme. Let me see what it's colorful. Okay. So this is a colorful theme, as you can see. and it's still on black let me apply one more time the theme a light theme
and now you will see all the these things similar to the stock android stuff which you get on pixel phones so it's a nice thing that the oxygen os is also moving to the pixel kind of stock ui and it's a very uh, convenient thing for all of us so let me go to dark theme one more time because i like the dark theme on oxygen os version but basically it's a purely stock android kind of theme and i like this particular stuff from the oneplus so let's go to the again community page and see the change log and as you can see the android p gesture navigation so let's go to the settings and buttons and gestures and here you will find a different option navigation bar and gestures a customization option will give you all this customization which were already present in oxygen os there is a fixed navigation bar uh, this back and home button which is android p kind of navigation so as you can see there is a tiny uh, line over here and a back button this is uh, one more uh, navigation gestures and again a third navigation gesture is similar to the what we have earlier seen in the oneplus devices like if you want to go back you can just swipe and go back if you hold this from the middle of you will find this all this multitasking uh, applications and all these stuffs so uh, two types of different navigation gestures has been added in open beta 1 one. one is android p navigation gestures and this is oxygen os navigation gestures uh, let's move to the next one other new features and improvement you can see a different features categories uh, has been added in this particular uh, new open beta 1 again they have integrated one plus customization features and accent color customization so let's go to the display and uh, here you will find accent color customization options you can choose any color you want for your uh, customization and again do not disturb mode customization again go to the sound and setting option over here and here you will find do not disturb and again there are tons of customization options available over here gaming mode customization so let's go to the gaming mode and uh, i think it will be in utilities okay gaming mode and agar and again few options has been added like how to show notifications and notification for third party calls and all these things so these changes has been done in android 9.0 open beta 1 and and these are the known issues and i will use this uh, phone for next 4 to 5 days to find out if there is any major issue or not i don't find any major issue as of now uh let me turn on the google play store and it's working fine no issues so they have mentioned that uh google play store might show device is not certified by google so this particular known issue is not appearing in my case again google pay services this is not available in india right now and the first one some application may not be function as expected so i will check this particular stuff in next coming 4 5 days to inform you how is this uh, particular uh, update is it a good stable update or it still needs an improvement otherwise uh, this is a camera ui again this is a phone ui completely pixel kind of uh, look and uh, this is messaging stuff so overall this update consist of a pixel kind of theme and looks in android p 9.0 and i hope there should not be any major bug involved in this particular update if you have any doubts or queries please write down in the comment section i will try to answer them individually one by one and i will also make a dedicated video on this particular uh, android 9.0 review after using my device for 4 to 5 days and also i will show you how to roll back from this uh, open beta 1 to stable version Uh, again i will make a dedicated video in the next week to roll back from open beta 1 to stable version so guys that's it for today's video and i hope you like this video if you like this video please hit like and subscribe to our channel we will see in the next upcoming video till then thank you very much and see you soon